Tonight, New York comes out to share. So we are at Pier 60 at Chelsea Piers for the annual share benefit. Tonight's event is staffed by women chefs and women chefs only. We are in store for some really great cuisine and also some fantastic cocktails. It's a great cause. It benefits both ovarian cancer and breast cancer research. And the people who are here are truly dedicated to that cause. We're going to meet some of them now, sample their food, and of course, try some of those great drinks. Why is this an important cause? Well, first, because it's a woman's cause. There is not enough attention given to this, and even if it's only once a year, to me, it's very important to be here. Well, I think the crowd here is just amazing, and um, it's a really great cause. This year, hundreds of people have come out to support SHARE, and there's no other place I'd rather be tonight, that's for sure. Well, I think it kind of hits home personally for some of us, and I know whether through home experiences or work experiences, everyone is touched by breast cancer, ovarian cancers. You know, we love it because we not only do something that makes us feel good for, for a really good uh, cause, and SHARE is a terrific organization, but we get to see each other and yeah. hang out later on. I cut up a bunch of wieners today. She Duck was, dogs. She, uh, I've been doing this for six years, she worked more than any other celebrity that had been with us, seriously. We have over 650 people who are eating and drinking and bidding on the silent auction, on the live auction. It's really an amazing, an amazingly wonderful evening. What is it you think about the hospitality industry in particular, that they come out in such droves for these sorts of causes? In the hospitality industry, they, they get tapped because they have a skill and an item that people are attracted to. And also, I think there is a generosity of spirit that the hospitality industry, particularly in New York, has. Mm -hmm. So I think that it's a it's a wonderful combination. So Julie, tell us, this apparently is the signature cocktail of tonight's event. Tell us what it is. It's called a Queen's Park Swizzle. It's essentially, it's a um, an aged rum mojito. It's done with the uh, crushed ice that we churn with our swizzle stick, muddled mint, demerara syrup, and um, aged rum. I had a couple of favorites. We had some cupcakes that were really good, um, sausage back there, lobster rolls are a big hit, yeah. Anybody who's come here once wants to come to this event again because this is not like a regular fundraising event. This is a fabulous Manhattan night on the town and people love it. So the combination is a great one. It is awesome and I am coming back every year hereafter, I have to say. Only at an event for breast cancer research would you see a shocking pink Vespa. This is only one of a thousand in the United States. It's a special limited edition vehicle and it was auctioned off tonight for $5,600. Lots of money raised for a phenomenal cause. I think we, we just need to take this Vespa and jet off and get some more food. But in the meantime, remember, join us next time on New York Insider TV, the place where the beautiful people come to play. Well, I heard they had to empty the gas tank so that they made sure nobody drove off with it at the event. Well, I don't think that's the danger with me because I got to learn how first, I think.